You hear Rydell back at the garage? I, I wasn't really paying attention. What do you say? Do you know how many times I've heard the we're a family speech? Trust me, the only person you should be loyal to is yourself. Yes, quiet. Hey, Rydell. Hey, just wanted to wish you both luck for the big race. You got this. Thanks, Pops. Just remember, don't just say shit. Win shit. Win shit. That's right. Well, break it. Don't know where I'm going with this. See you back at the garage. What was that about? Maybe he's just trying to apologize. It usually starts with sorry. Well, that's just Rydell. He's old school. Yeah, old something. <laughs> Yo, looks like Alex here. Do your thing. I told him to look out for us. He was very interested in our car. So let's not disappoint. to you? You playing tag with them? Baby! That's what I'm talking about. They don't even know what hit them. I 
I told you, baby driver. My brains, your skills. Match made in race in heaven. And Rydell's rides. Wait till he hears about this. Pride is gonna be real. Yeah, he might even break out the grill in his dad's secret marinade. Oh shit, hold up. Alex calling. What up, fam? Yeah, impressive, huh? Little garage run by... I told you, bro. I don't know, like a bunch. A bunch of what? What, tonight? Yeah, you know it. Thanks. Peace. All right. What was that about? Alex gig. Wait, now? I, I thought we were going back to the garage. Transport job. Simple pick up and drop off. He's sending over the info now. We're not passing this up. It's our time, yo. All right, fine. Let's do this. I don't know, Yaz. This seems sketchy. What did I say about taking risks? If we impress this guy, we'll reap the benefits. But there's no second chances. Do you have any idea what ride we're picking up? Knowing my boy, something legit. Damn, yes. Nice. You take it. I'll drive out to the drop-off behind you. On it. We're keeping this little job between us, right? Ooh, don't mind if I do. location. Let's not wait around. For sure. I can't wait to see what this thing can do. Shit! Damn it! Jasmine, is this car hot? Uh, maybe. Let's split up. I'll meet you at the drop-off. Got it. Stay safe. Suspect just lost us at University Central. Spread out. Terminating pursuit. Come on, Yaz. Pick up. Pick up. Yo, it's Yaz. Leave a message and I might get back to you. 
Probably won't, but I might. Yo, Yaz, where are you? I'm at the drop-off and there's nothing here. Are you sure this Alec guy gave you the right address? Shit! Yes, the garage alarm just went off. Are you satisfied with this message? Screw it. Gotta get back to the garage. for calling Rydell's Rides. Call back during normal business hours. Shit. Yo, it's Yaz. Leave a message and I might get back to you. Probably won't, but I might. Shit! Where is everybody? No, no, no. <sighs> Shit, Rydell, you okay? They emptied a lot. Wait here. Shit! I knew it. I told y'all. Jasmine, who is that? I don't know that dude. Yeah, let's go. They just said your name. Rydell, she was with me all night. Who did you tell about this place? I didn't. You didn't what? You didn't go to the Heights? Laugh about how trusting the old man is? Well, who's gonna trust me now? Hold up! Took your ass in when no one else wanted you. Whoa, Rydell, you gotta chill. Yes! Wait! What the hell? Did she just take the car? Kia, she took everything. They said no one could clean up Lakeshore. She grabbed the mob. Re-elect Mayor Morgan Stevenson, the leader Lakeshore deserved. Hey, Rydell. Kind of dead again today. Oh, some little lady came in for an oil change. She didn't have any money, though. Just samosas. Yours is in the fridge. Well... I'm gonna lock up for now, see if I can make a few extra bucks on this side. Oh, I cleaned out the storeroom, and dude, you were right. It's a possum, not a rat. So, yeah. He's still in there. Oh, hey, the book you ordered came in. Bro, if you ever need to talk, I'm here. I'll be in early tomorrow to open up, okay? Peace. All right. Who needs a ride? Ride Dell's rides. Need a lift? Hey, name's Tess. 
Heard you might be a good person to call for a cheap ride. I'll hit you with the address and where I'm heading. No sweat. Be there soon. Yeah, I was like, yo, bro. And yo, check this, bro. He was all like, if you know, you know, bro. And you know what I said? <laughs> bro! Yeah, hi. Um, Tess? Yo! Yo, I'm running a little late, so if you could, uh, you know. I got you. What? Do you have a pet chinchilla or like a... A possum or something? Um, no. Why? Really? No reason. I'm just gonna crack this window. So, what's this address? Headed to this empty lot off the underpass. You know it? That was an old meetup spot for local street racers. Oh, you race? Well, something like that. Anyways, cops have that spot pretty locked down now. <laughs> the scene's about to get a big shakeup from what I hear. Wait, really? Mm-hmm. If you know, you know. And I know, bro. So what's up? You're in the racing scene, but you don't have a car? Real Gs get rides. I also like being on time. Yo, does this thing go any faster? Five stars. Great conversation. Hey, you should stick around. Might be worth your while. Oh, yeah. Thanks for the advice. I've not seen this many racers in one place in a minute. Brought everyone back out. The love of racing, bruh. The need to express oneself behind the wheel. And money also. Yeah, probably money. I forgot how much I missed this. <laughs> I can see why. I'm gonna do the rounds, figure out what's up. Thanks for the lift, Speedy. That's my car. Yes? All right, all right, focus up. Let's go. I'm glad to see y'all showed up. How many years has it been, for real? The man cracks down a little bit and we all bitch out? I thought this was Lakeshore. I thought this was a racing scene. Flex in with your super tuners and your muscle cars. That guy. Woo. What's it gonna take, huh, to remind you why we got into this? Stacks. 
Nailed it. Three qualifiers, high risk. You have a run-in with the cops, you take them on. You make it, and I will see you in the finals. The Lakeshore Grand. You wanna win? Then you had better be the best. You still want that five star rating? Then show me what you got. Five stars? I got you. You better get us out of here. I have unpaid jaywalking fines. Who's just taking us out? I don't think they noticed. Hit them harder. Those cops sure do give up easy! Kidding! I'll find this punk if it's the last thing I do out here today. I'm calling it off. I was sensing some hostility between you and Miss Monologue back there. That what you saw back there, that's my car that she's driving. Weird. Looked like her car. That she was driving. She even had the front to keep the license plate. Wait till Rydell hears this. Who? Oh, he, uh, he runs the garage. This garage? Is it nearby? I'm thinking now's a good time for us to get off the street. Yeah, no kidding. On it. This is it. Rydell's rides. Not bad. I think he's a little work. <laughs> so, this is where Yaz started off, huh? Get the hell out of my shop! Wasn't me! Whoa, whoa! Kid, you triggered the alarm system. Hey, no touching. Sorry, this is Tess. I almost took your head off. Nice to meet you, slugger. Right on. I saw Jasmine. She just rolled up at this meetup. You kidding? She still had the car. And she's still with that same crew that jacked our garage, setting up some high stakes circuit called the Lakeshore Grand. <laughs> Corny. With our car. I need to beat her. I need the garage. I need your help. Slow down, kid. Now let's say you do this, okay? And you throw down with Jasmine, and you beat her in a street race. So what? So what? That's what this garage was about. Now look at this place. We're fine. This yours? Didn't I say no touching? Mr. Rides of Rydell's Rides. Love that name, by the way. Full disclosure. I went to that meetup tonight looking for a racer. And then the cops showed up and I was like, cops? <laughs> oh yeah. And the kid was crazy fast outrunning him. Now, I'm thinking, learn from the best. Listen, I got what you need, cash. And you two got what I want, a reason to win. How about I make an investment in this garage, rep you in the race, maybe open some doors. Come on, Randall. I can win. We can bring this place back. I'm in. Woohoo! Just promise me, no matter what Jasmine does, you do it the right way. Deal? Deal. So, Rydell, got any rides out back? Welcome to Rydell's Rides.
I have some customers looking for a delivery that could help us earn some cash before the next race. Nice. Judging by this place, you used to race yourself. Uh, sure did. Hey, if you're cruising around the lake, could you pick up a car for me? A Buick Grand National. They wanted to see how fast it can go with a real driver behind the wheel. You know any? <laughs> wow, the dad joke energy is real today. Drop me a pin. Sure. A pin. Right. Send me the location. On it. And I'm pretty excited. The Regal from hell. Classic 80s muscle. My pop's dream car. He called it the Corvette Killer. So you better make him proud. No pressure. Is that the suspect we're after? Sure looks like it. Yo! I'm gonna do a little digging about Yaz and the crew she's rolling with. I have a feeling she isn't the only one behind the grant. Really? Wow, um, wow, I'm curious, what gave it away? The huge prize money? Maybe she's been giving rides to randos for cash. In your car. Anywho, I'm craving boba. Peace! Delivered, safe and sound. Pretty fast, not as fast as me, but... Anyway, customer said he would follow us on Insta. Do we have an Insta? Is that a coffee machine? Didn't Tess set one up? Where? In the kitchen? No, 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 no. It's a social media account. Oh, right, that at Mr. Rod thing. Hold on, okay, in. There's a video of a dog skateboarding and people eating dumplings out of expensive sneakers. Okay, I'll figure it out. Uh, no, she, wait, hold on, she saw a dog skateboarding? Not the point I was making. Later, kid. Today at City Hall, Mayor Stevenson announced increased funding for the Lakeshore PD. Cars are causing havoc on our streets. After last night's high-speed antics endangering the good citizens of Lakeshore, I'm pushing my no-nonsense-for-nonsense policy into action. Make sense? Nonsense.
paying jobs if you're willing to get your hands dirty. Woo! A little extra cash wouldn't hurt. But Rydell doesn't know won't hurt him, right? Because that worked out so well last time. Hmm? The garage got jacked. And now I'm trying to win my, my car back. Any of this ring a bell? Uh-huh. Ooh, 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 don't forget my cut. I don't want to have to break your thumbs. <laughs> JK, blood makes me squeamish. Well, I'm getting ramen and watching that new reality show where they put naked people on stage and make them sing for clothes. Season finale. <gasps> Maybe one of them will finally get socks. <laughs> See ya. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Joining the others in pursuit of the suspect. Not sure how much more gas we have left in the tank here. just vanished at University Central. I'm in 
engaging the driver dispatch. Control, this is patrol. We're going after this racer, too. Damn, this one is slippery. We lost him. So, Big Shot, you find anything out about Jasmine and her crew? Not much, but may I just say, thank you for calling me Big Shot. Mm. <laughs> Don't push it. Sounds like Jasmine's running with the crew from Cyril Heights. They keep everything pretty low-key. I just know they have big money, so we better be ready. The Heights. <laughs> Don't worry. The kid will be. In the fast lane. Just what I want to hear. So Major Talent is planning on taking over a district tonight. Major Talent? What, like a, a racer? My lips are sealed, Speedy. Let's just say, you'll want to make an impression. The only thing leaving an impression is the vagueness of these calls. It's all part of the mystique. So what's the deal tonight? No cops, only racers. No cops? How'd they manage that? I don't ask those type of questions. All I know is it's cop free and you gotta bring some style. You know that thing cool people have? Oh, right, yeah, cool people, like you. Exactly. Some advice from one cool cat. Maybe spruce up your wheels a little. You wanna bring the show, right? Look, I like my ride. Aw, I know you do. But this ain't the 90s anymore. Chased by the LPD. Going after the suspects. I'm no worry yet. Dispatch, we're out for now. Sorry.
alive and you'll lose it eventually. Lamborghini Aventador. Belongs to a buddy of mine, and he wants to see what this supercar's got. Whoa, that's a sweet ride. Your buddy's not messing around. Send me the deets. Done. Aventador is right where it should be. And faster than I could have done it. It's nice to be getting back to work again after, well, you know, customers coming back, and you're a big part of it. It's the least I can do. Hey, the past is a pass. Deep, you should print that on some t-shirts. And give them away free with all changes. Hmm. Huh. Later. So, I'm still unclear, okay? How's the kid gonna get the car back? I'm hearing Yaz never backs down from a challenge. Apparently, she's pretty stubborn. Probably why we got along. I mean, used to. We just have to catch her at the perfect moment. Put her reputation on the line. Yeah, well, whatever she does, remember, don't bring the heat down on the garage. I like to think of this plan as a fluid plan. As in... It's fluid? Ah, now you're getting it! Um, I heard you help people out. From time to time. Can you get to me now? Absolutely. Hang tight. Hey, Tess. So, I heard the community have been setting challenges for each other. I'm listening. You beat it, they'll pay out. For real? That sounds too easy. Okay. Then I expect to be rolling around on a bed of C notes at the end of every day.
boost? Heard you, uh, needed a boost. <sighs> Original. Can you get me out of here fast? It's what I do. <sighs> Thanks. I needed that. Don't like trouble. You and me both. You cool? Yeah. So, look, I I'm not gonna lie. You seem a little shy. Doesn't that go against street racing? Dunno, uh, does it? Yeah, I'm mean, usually after being chased by the cops, the adrenaline is really pumping, and people generally don't stop talking. So, what got you into it? Saw this anime when I was a kid. Really stuck with me. Oh yeah, like a like a cartoon. Cartoon? Anime is not a cartoon. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, what was it about? It was set in the mountains in Japan. These two street racers work together until, bam! One of them betrays the other. After that, they battle it out to win the final race. Damn, maybe I should check that out. I kind of want to know how it ends. You have no idea. I've never seen anything like it before. The colors, that art style, amazing. You seem pretty hyped about it. It was like someone turned on a switch in my brain. You never seen any anime? I, I didn't get to watch much growing up. Shame. I can recommend some stuff to you if you're interested. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I guess so, yeah. It's amazing, life-changing. It helped me, it helped me a lot. It really does sound like it had a positive impact on you. It did. Did you know that anime began in 1956? Nope. And did you know that 60% of the world's animation is anime? <laughs> Not until now. Thanks for the ride. That was some good looking out. Anytime. <laughs> Look, I'm gonna hit you up with some recommendations, all right? You know, you, you really don't have to. Most of my spare time is going into racing, so. <laughs> nah, nah, it's okay. I don't mind. I'll send you some wrecks. Trust me, you'll love them. Chase dispatch. You want me to try backwards or something? Means nothing right now. Traffic.
I'm no worried yet. that I pass you. 